Hey, this is Scott. <laughs> this is Jay. And this is Scott and Jay show. And we're talking about complex carbs this yes. morning. Yes, complex Jay's carbs. Got, Jay's got like a whole wheat bagel. That's a whole wheat bagel. And fat free cream cheese. My fat. Finger your food there. Yeah, they go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> Can I have a new bagel? <laughs> no bagel, no bagel, no bagel. Yeah. So it's Saturday. It's a beautiful day here in Bartlesville, Oklahoma, Starbucks Studios. And uh, so we have our. Uh, are starting our weekly Yelp update, yep. and so not a lot of movers today. No, there, there's one. I know. Was of. there one? There yeah. was two, I thought. Uh, yeah, yeah, maybe. We yeah. added Boulevard Diner to the list, and uh, what else was there? Let's go with the bottom bucket. Okay, so I'll do the one stars first. All right. Uh, at the bottom of the bucket, there was uh, McDonald's. Uh, now, once again, these are not our personal opinions. This is, these are star reviews from Yelp. Yep. So be sure and use your Yelp application on your phone when you're dining in Bartlesville to help everyone know where the best places to eat are, mm. good tips, tips on uh, healthy eating, whatnot. So here you go. McDonald's and Quench Buds. Quench Buds on uh, Dewey here in Bartlesville. Both got one stars. How about those, how about those uh, two stars there, Jay? Hey, but the two stars, uh, Bronze Ice Cream has two stars. Wendy's with two, Garfield's with two, Boulevard Diner gets into the uh, mix with two and a half stars. You know, Garfield's, they used to like to go to Garfield's. I, I, I kind of do. There's, they've got an okay a menu. Uh, they used to have a really good turkey burger, but they, they got rid of it. Mm. Um, so I haven't gone in a while as well. More uh, two and a half stars, uh, <coughs> Montana Mike's, Billy Sims Barbecue, Hunan, and Moss. <coughs> Monterey's, Monterey's got, uh, I like their, they've got a good salad, a chicken salad. That, Do they? Uh, yeah, it's got chicken and uh, green peppers and tomatoes and a little guacamole on it. Or not guacamole, but avocados. Right. Avocados are great. Uh, that was weird. It kind of flashed on us. Yeah. Triple wrap pad. It's going to be okay. It's, you shouldn't have dropped it. Three so, stars. Three stars. Moving up the charts. Uh, game time pizza with three. Subway. Lauder Burger. Both actually, both lot of burgers were three stars. Tumbleweeds, Freddy's, which Buffalo Wild Wings, the Pizza Place, Chili's Grill and Bar, McAllister's Grill, and Sterling's Grill. All, all the three stars. Three stars. Three and a half stars. Daylight Donuts on Frank Phillips, mm -hmm. Egbert's, uh, Wheezy's Cafe, Szechuan, mm -hmm. Copper Restaurant, Luigi's. I like Luigi's uh, spaghetti and meatballs. Hey, Luigi's. Rib crib. Went to rib. I had to say rib crib last night. We got their uh, St. Louis style ribs. Mm. Baby. Fall off the bone goodness right there. Uh, La Fiesta, three and a half stars. Murphy's, three and a half. And Dink's, three and a half. Oh, I love me some Dink's. I, I can't say enough about Dink's. Yeah, Dink's barbecue. Put that on Cheerios. Oh, gosh, yeah. I could, I could eat my shoe with Dink's barbecue sauce. Is this Blake? A soul? This is really good. Oh, it's just my shoe? Hmm, I'll have six. It's my Justin Roper? <laughs> uh, so, moving up to four stars Domino's, Pizza Hut, Nan King, Quench Buds, Million Dollar Elm, Burger Hot, Cup and Cake, TK's, Steakhouse. Have also, with TK's yet? Yes, I have. Yeah, I, right. They've got a good uh, chicken salad there as well. Yeah. Uh, Midway Cafe, Casa Tamales, Ocean China, my favorite Chinese place. The Painted Horse, and Painted Horse has a good, they call it a vegetable salad, which is kind of funny. Because it's got vegetables in it already. If it's a salad, it's vegetable. Right. But they've got, extra, <laughs> they've got extra veggies. It's really good. And they've got a good um, basil vinegar. Like having a rice, rice. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Jude's for your health, another good healthy yeah, place. Yeah, 22 reviews there. And Frank and Lola's the uh, all-star with uh, four stars with 53 reviews. I think we'll be going to uh, Frank and Lola's for our anniversary this week. Mm. Yeah. Four and a half stars, uh, pies and such. Have you been to pies and such? Uh, I, I might have had something there. I had a such, maybe. <laughs> Starbucks at four and a half. Starbucks. And that's here for Starbucks. Indian coffee, the rolling pin, and La Tienda El Rincon. Rin 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 Whatever. Yeah. La Tienda in the Comanche Center. Yes. So there that's you the go. place that's I can't remember where it's at. Yeah. And the five stars hit The five jet. stars. Daylight Donuts on No Water Road. The Great American Grill at the uh, Hilton Garden Hotel. Great uh, veggie. 
veggie burger there, by the way. Uh, hideaway Pizza, excellent service. Uh, the employees service. there are really good. Yep. Uh, Trevor Peters, by the way. And the number one. With 11 reviews. 11 reviews, five stars, sushi, one. Keep reaching for this. Keep your feet on the ground and keep reaching for this. Oh man, I listened to a Casey Kasem show uh, from 1971, um, and I forgot what the number one show uh, song was back then. 1971? Yeah, it's like Jesus Seriously? Christ Superstar was on there like twice. Um, no, I wasn't even born at that point. You weren't? No. No, I wouldn't have been born for another year. So, anyway, football coming up today. we got Tulsa and Tulane. Now, Tulsa and Tulane was Thursday night. Oh, was Thursday that night. was an excellent game. It started out kind of slow, 0-0, I think, at the end of the first frame. And then uh, it ended in double overtime with Tulsa winning 38-31. Awesome game. It was a lot of fun. Awesome game. Even though cool. I almost passed out of the game. So OSU and uh, Florida State tonight at big seven. Big game, yeah, big game for the Big Twelve. Are you sure it's on TV? It's on TV. It's on ABC. It is. Yes. Good. Yep. And then OU plays. OU plays La Tech. La Tech. And that's going to be on uh, pay per view. You and it's a a, it's a shameful pay for pay per view. Pay per view. Do I pay say you pay pay for view? <laughs> pay per view. Pay for view. <laughs> Whatever. You have to pay it, pay it to view it. Uh, you can go to uh, Simple Simon's Pizza tonight. They're having uh, eight dollar all you can eat pizza, wings, and salad bar, and you can watch the game at Simple Simon's. Yes, at Simple yeah. Simon's. I will be there along with my boy and okay. several other OU fans. Right. Where's I'm going to be Simon's? eating salad. It's. Uh, in the Red Apple area, okay. I forget what okay. they call yeah, it, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. by La, La Quinta. I'm surprised more places aren't going to be showing the OU game. With like the OSU game on being free at yeah. when do you play? 7 o'clock. Oh, well. Yeah. All right, so, so there you go. Big teams, Tulsa's a 1-0 in, in uh, Conference A, American Conference. Uh, they're off to a good start, undefeated. Awesome. The only undefeated team in, in uh, the American Conference. Yeah. They're the only well, yeah, other team to play was Tulane. Tulsa beat Tulane. They did honor uh, Devin Walker. He was the kid that got uh, his neck broken at TU in 2012. Oh, yeah. I remember watching the game and just absolutely devastated when that guy, it was just, there was like 15 seconds left to go in the half and just a flute play, ran into his own player, broke his neck, changed his life forever. And just, this was awful. But he was there, and thank the fans, thanks, thank the uh, TU medical staff and St. St. Francis for all their hard work. Um, my wife misspelled Christy's yeah. name. My yeah. wife misspelled our daughter's name. Well, you know. <laughs> So it drives this week. Christy crazy when you put an I E at the end. Oh, yeah. It's just an I, and my wife spelled it with an I E. Probably, probably autocorrect, but yeah, she misspelled my daughter's name. I can't believe it. Went to California this week. So yeah, Beverly Hills. Moved to California. Um, drove to Beverly Hills, Rodeo Drive. Board, we can go morning. We'll take the sunshine, take us there. Little Hawk Nelson. And, uh, who? Hawk Nelson. Christian Bale. Oh. One of my favorites. So how so was all... California? Yeah. No you went cares. to Holly no Weird. Cares now. You went to Holly Weird. Holly Weird. Yeah. No. No Did the Ice Hollywood. Bucket Challenge at the, the ice bucket challenge Renaissance. The Renaissance Hotel. And it, his fun. ice bucket was a trash can. The Renaissance trash can, yeah. Yes, the people puked in. That's the uh, guy there at the front desk. Can you fill this up with ice and water? And he's like... Yeah, hang on. You know that's not, Here you go. You know that's not an ice bucket, don't you? I was like, yeah, I need something bigger than your room in-room ice bucket. Yeah. Got a shot glass. Okay, there we go. Wee! <laughs> <laughs> it's like Mike Dick. Size and some water. Did you see Mike Dick could do his? Uh-huh. So that the whole ESPN crew did the ice bucket challenge, and 
Mike Dicka comes on and he's got this cup and he pours it on his hand and goes, ooh, that's cool. So I think that's kind of over with now. Uh, you I'm know what? The I, they were talking about it this morning that uh, the ALS Foundation, $100 million. This time last year, they were only at $3 million. $100 million. That's amazing. That's amazing. Just by people last week, they were at 53. Last Saturday, yeah. they were at 53. Yeah. Just by million. people pouring water on their head. And donating whatever. 10 bucks, 100 yeah. bucks. That's great. That's really impressive. So that'll change the face of... Uh, fundraising and social media, uh, you know, fundraising on social media. You know, this this gonna is going to be something like that. You're, you're going to have books written about people. Oh, yeah, people will be right. studying this for a long time. So think about how um, contagious it is that you pick out an, a cause, something that's easy easy to uh, visualize, call easy out to some replicate, friends, and. Uh, you know, post it. It's going to be easy to do, easy to donate to. The only thing they didn't do on this one was you couldn't donate online or through your phone. You had to send a check or stuff like that, I, I think. So, just think, if they would have done it online, they probably could have been $200 million at this yeah. point. Yeah, and that, then that, they'll probably have that capability in the you know, upcoming. Yeah. Hey, hey Scott, Thanks, did you see that right over there? Yeah. Right there. So it's relatively quiet here today at yeah, the uh, Starbucks Since studio. They busted their blender. The blender got <laughs> busted. All right, we're hitting the 11 minute mark here. So we really appreciate you guys checking in, mom, and uh, my mom. And my, so the two of you guys, the two of our fans watching. My, the, yeah. yeah. My brother Ben and Dan and their kids. My dad watches. He really? said he, he, uh, he said he cracked up watching last week's. Last Did week's was funny. It was pretty funny. Thank you, last week's not so funny. Oh, thank you. Uh-huh. <laughs> we were really, yeah, we had a two week hiatus and then we came back on strong. And so there you go. I think we're both, I'm, I know I'm tired from the trip this week. It just oh, I'm tired out. from your treat, trip. Too. Treat. Treat. And, uh, I cannot talk today. So uh, I think that's about. Oh! Uh, before we end, because last week we didn't get to it, well, no, something happened it. with the video. Last week we couldn't, the week before we couldn't get to it. But this week, uh, hang on, let me pull it up. Here's the uh, new numbers on procrastination. Amazing. So, yeah, so the new do, numbers, the new numbers on procrastination.